A car that is turning is affected by centrifugal force, a force that tries to push the car outwards towards the outside of the turn. When speed is constant, the strength of the centrifugal force is determined by the radius of the turn that the car is making. This also means that as the car's turning radius becomes bigger, there is less effect from centrifugal force on the car. Imagine going around a corner at the largest radius or arc possible. You would enter the corner on the outer side of the track and you would be at the innermost side at the center of the corner. Then you would go through the outer side of the track again at its exit. This is the out-in-out -out maneuver. Now let's try actually driving out-in-out -out through a corner. A car that is turning is affected by centrifugal force, a force that tries to push the car outwards towards the outside of the turn. When speed is constant, the strength of the centrifugal force is determined by the radius of the turn that the car is making. This also means that as the car's turning radius becomes bigger, there is less effect from centrifugal force on the car. Imagine going around a corner at the largest radius or arc possible. You would enter the corner on the outer side of the track and you would be at the innermost side at the center of the corner. Then you would go through the outer side of the track again at its exit. This is the out-in-out -out maneuver. Now let's try actually driving out-in-out -out through a corner. Continuing from lesson 17, try driving through a corner in an out-in-out -out line. Drive on the outer side of the track at the corner exit, going to the inner side of the track, then pass through the outer side of the track on the way out of the corner. 
The key to driving smoothly is to use the full width of the track, going to the inner side. Continuing from lesson 17, try driving through a corner in an out-in-out -out line. Drive on the outer side of the track at the corner exit, going to the inner side of the track, then pass through the outer side of the track on the way out of the corner. The key to driving smoothly is to use the full width of the track.
Continuing from lesson 17, try driving through a corner in an out-in, out line. Drive on the outer side of the track at the corner exit. Going to the inner side of the track, then pass through the outer side of the track on the way out of the corner.